I'm Chad Poole with Stalls TV. Today we're going to be talking about laying out pre-cut letters and numbers. Generally, when you'll receive your pre-cut letters and numbers, they will come in packs such as this or this. Today, we're going to be talking about laying out a ba basketball garment as well as a baseball garment using 6-inch numbers, 8-inch numbers, as well as 2-inch letters. Layout boards generally come as a half moon shape, allowing you to either do a straight line or a half moon, such as an arch. Today I'm going to be demonstrating just that. So we'll do about three, four fingers off the collar. Another good tip is to make sure that your layout board, that you're even on both sides here. We're going to be doing the name Edgar. Now since this is a smaller name, we'll generally want to start from about the three point. If you had a larger name such as Williams, Williamson, you might want to come back from here. That way you can utilize the whole board. Five letters in the name will allow us to put the middle, middle letter in the center. Just like that, we have a nice arch. We'll remove the board. Once again, use our cover sheet. And press. Now that that is complete, this will also help us lay out our numbers. Generally about two to three fingers down. Cover sheet again. And just like that, you have a perfect arched name and number. For our next application, we're going to be applying pre-cuts to a youth three-quarter baseball shirt. When I was talking before about the layout board, what's nice about it is you can lay out the arch names and numbers. What most folks do is they will physically lay the wording out on a table utilizing our thermo tape. Now thermo tape is a heat resistant tape that will allow you to align a name such as Wilson here properly and straight. So we'll go ahead and utilize our layout board to ensure that we have a proper name. And just like that, we're pretty good. Now what we'll want to do is this comes on a special holder. We'll want to pull a little bit more than the length of the name. Cut it off. And we will gently, using extra pressure on our thumbs here, push it down and make sure that all of our letters are touching. Now what we'll do is since the shirt is threaded, we're going to be backwards. Make sure our adhesion side is down and we will simply lay Wilson directly on the garment. You will want to heat apply with the tape on there. Always use a cover sheet. Generally about 10 seconds, we're at a four pressure. The machine will automatically pop open for me. Remove our cover sheet. But give it a second, wave it out a little bit. We do want to get our tape off as soon as possible. So these are some of the simple ways that we can lay out our pre-cut letters and numbers efficiently. Utilizing our boards, our tape, we can come out with a perfect straight name, perfect arch name, as well as help to line up your numbers. I'm Chad Poole and thank you for watching Stalls TV.